Well, hello and welcome to a new video. You may notice that I have a different background, which can only mean one thing. I finally reorganized my whole makeup collection. I didn't declutter anything. It was really more of a giant Tetris game with my makeup and my drawers and where do I put what and how I organize it so that it makes sense to me and so that it's easy to access. I had originally planned to film the whole process and I started but honestly it was kind of complicated for me to film everything to find the right angles every time I just wanted to get this done. I did it all in one day which I didn't think was possible but I did it and uh, so yeah I figured you know what I'm not going to film the process I'm not going to show a before and after and today you just get the after. So basically this video is just me showing you my makeup collection, how I arrange it in my drawers. I'm not going to go into detail. Um, I think maybe one day I will do a more detailed makeup collection series focusing on specific categories. So let me know if this is something that you would like to see. But in the meantime, let's just check it out. So here is an overall of what it looks like. Starting with my desk, I have my brushes here, organized, of course, a mirror, my big lamp, sorry if it's too bright. Uh, in here, I have the box of the makeup I have on my face. I always put everything in a box so that I can... Um, Put it down in the description box of the video that you're watching in this little tower stuff i have in here and there i have a bunch of setting sprays these are the sponges uh that i used uh some lip products again lip products in here i have my mario badescu sprays which i never really use but whatever and this is for my brows. Here I have makeup remover, uh, a water mist, again lip products. And on the top shelf I have what I use to clean my brushes on the spot. I have the skincare I'm currently using in the morning, uh, cotton swabs, and these are my oils and my gua sha. On the side I have this full of tools, uh, eyelash curler, uh, what I use to shave my face, hair, accessories, just a bunch of stuff and some tissues. And under my desk I have my trash basically, my wipes and right there we have the brushes that I use that are dirty that I need to clean. So I have a set of Alex drawers who's surprised. Uh, we're gonna start with the bottom drawer. So in here I have my concealers. Uh, this is high-end, this is drugstore, my uh, loose powders, my powder puffs, more loose powders here, and back there I have a bunch of extra stuff. In here we have uh, powders, powder foundations, uh, finishing powders, and in the back some of my face palettes. This is the bronzer drawers, so I have drugstore, high-end, and then a mix of creams, and then more high-end again. In the back, I have my contour palettes. This is the blush drawer. So we have a drugstore, a mix of both, and high-end. We have some creams in the back and palettes. And my super full highlighter drawer. This is way too much. 
this is mostly high-end they have a few drugstore in here but yeah for the most part this is high-end highlighters and then in the back i have uh sticks and liquids and some palettes as well this is the first tower that we have with mostly lip products and there I have my MAC lipsticks. These are KVD and these are Catrice. Honestly, they're here because they just look nice all together. I put little lights in here, but unfortunately with the big light, you don't really see them. These are all of my NYX mini lipsticks, uh, which were in this thing right there, but I just never used them because of it. And so in here, I feel like it's just aesthetically pleasing and that way I can actually reach for them if I want to. I have drugstore liquid lipsticks, drugstore glosses, high-end liquid lipsticks, more high-end liquid lipsticks, high-end glosses and more high-end glosses in here i have my bullet lipsticks this organization doesn't make much sense but it was the best way i found for now uh in here i have a uh, high-end again uh high-end crayons and then drugstore drugstore and high-end I have my lip pencils. These are just random. It's a mix of both drugstore and high-end. And this is just my NYX mini pencils. In the back, I actually have an empty box. This way, I can access this more easily. And it doesn't look that empty. And in these little things, I have brows. Again, drugstore, high-end. Uh, lash glue, mascaras, same thing, high-end drugstore, and my lashes. Now these might change over time, but this is what we have at the moment. This, however, is full of uh, foundation. So I tried to find a way which made sense but not sure this is gonna stay that way this is i have um cushion foundations i have a couple of stick foundations and just um samples these are more um random so i have this uh fenty eavesdrop I don't really know where to put it. Same thing with the Charlotte Tilbury, the Becca light shifter that I still need to figure out how to use. And this is my uh, mixing pigment. And here I have drugstore foundations. Tube foundations, both drugstore and high-end. High-end foundations. And again, high-end foundations. Clearly, I have a thing for high-end foundations. In this first drawer, I have my nail polishes. And here I have other nail stuff. And this is just random things I might need to take pictures or make videos or whatever. This is all empty. And here I have my pencils. I have black pencils and colorful ones. In there, there's a bunch of liners, black, colorful, glittery, and some um, eyeshadow primer. These are my primers. I'm not sure this is gonna stay that way, but this is basically high-end. This is more drugstore, and these are the smaller ones that get lost in this bin. And in here, I have a bunch of sponges, uh, brushes. I have everything I need to clean my brushes as well. And this is 
the second tower, which contains mostly eyeshadows. So these are my high-end eyeshadow palettes. These are my drugstore eyeshadow palettes. And here I have small palettes. This is high-end. This is drugstore. And here I have some random single shadows. And these two Marc Jacobs that don't really fit anywhere else. Here's a bunch of uh, glittery stuff. And just straight up glitter. So that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to give this a thumbs up. You can also subscribe to my channel. And because it's free, why wouldn't you? And I will see you guys next time. Bye.